today is my video for the rest of my beauty favorites of 2018. So let's get started. My first one is the Radiant Glow Plus Argan Oil of Moroccan Lotion. You guys, this thing, it, this, first of all, it smells amazing, but it really hydrates. My girlfriend said uh, she's from Thailand. She swears by this stuff she uses all the time, so she had it at her house, and I just was like, where? I need some lotion, and she grabbed it, and it smells so good, and it is really, it's actually really moisturizing, and she's got really dry skin. And so I put this on almost every day. I just have fallen in love with it. Um, it's not the greatest package to travel, but you can always put it in something else. <laughs> I love it. Uh, my next one is Falling in Love from Philosophy. Um, the heart surrenders itself to another. It's whipped body cream. This stuff is to die for. It is to die for. I've used a little bit and I just got it probably... I've been using a lot of my Aragon oil, but this is just something if I go out at night with my girlfriends and I want to smell good too. Oh, it is delicious and soft and buttery. This is worth buying. I, lo I love Philosophy products. I am really starting to love it. My Pure Purity cleanser that I love so much, that is really, really nice. I just love their stuff. Um, for facial stuff, I just love my rose water. I use it almost every day. It's really soft, it settles my skin, it just makes it smell good, and it's just, it just has good ingredients to really settle my skin down. Um, I just, I love it. I just, it smells so good. Um, my next thing is this bad boy. I can't believe I never had one of these. So Sigma, they're, look, so Sigma came out with a little round one that goes on your thing. Um, my sink is round, so it would be, and it's really small, so it's like I'd, I wouldn't be able to do that, and I clean it in my sink in my bathroom. Um, but, so I just use this guy. I, why did I not have this a long time ago? It just amaz amazes me, this beauty. When you put it on top of there and it just cleans all your brushes. Um, hair wise, uh, goodie but oldie, Shaper Plus. Reminds me of high school when I spray this, I remember my big hair. <laughs> Who doesn't remember big hair and Shaper Plus? Like, I had the big one, the big one that's like this long, much longer. Like this is a standard good size, but that big giant one, my girlfriend and me had it and was sitting on our desk and you'd be like, shh, and <laughs> trying to get your, your bangs high. Oh, the good old eighties. Just brings me back to my childhood. And it smells really good and it works really well. My next thing is the Orbe Praise Beach, which I use all the time. I only use it when my hair is curly and it's a wave and shine spray. This is like my third one. <laughs> I love this stuff. And it smells so good and it's super easy and I don't, just makes it kind of messy and shiny. I love that stuff. I just, I know it's expensive. I know Orbe is expensive, but this stuff seriously works and it smells good and it's great for curly hair. Um, the next thing is a little mini one from Orbe, and this is the dry texture shampoo. I don't use this a ton, so I have a mini, but look how cute that is. <laughs> like, super cute. Um, I love his stuff. His stuff is just re really soft, it's gentle, it works on my hair really well, um, it's great for fine hair. On to some makeup that I've been raving about. Stilla, thank you for making these. These are gorgeous. There's new ones out in Ulta that I want to get. And we met a rep, the rep for Stilla, when we were there. And she was actually swatching the new ones that just came out. And this was months ago. And she's like, and we stopped, me and my daughter stopped, we look. We're like, are the new color, new colors? And she's like, yeah, you want to see? So she was like showing me. She's like, it's coming out in Ulta, da, da, da. These are the minis, the three pack I got. But I am definitely going to go. And there's a really good, like, it's like a burgundy color. It is gorgeous, she showed me. I don't know if they have it. I haven't been up to Ulta in a while, so I need to go up there, but I think these are great and worth every money. Um, you know who's coming out with ones are, um, Pixie is coming out with these. And who had them? Who was testing them on YouTube? I saw somebody and they were amazing on her. I could not believe how well they were. They worked. I don't know who it was. I can't remember who I was watching. Um, next thing is, I love this, put a lid on it. Um, the Balm Eye Primer. I've told you guys I haven't really found an eye primer that I really loved. My hair in my eye. I really love this. It's not sticky, it stays on, it dries really well, and I think it holds my makeup on. I mean, I don't, I think it's worked really well. Eyebrows. This stuff I've been using on my eyebrows, and it's made my eyebrows look thicker and 
more hair and it's a perfect color for my skin tone taupe blondes uh this is brow shape i don't know what color it is so you have the gel which i've not tried and you have the powder um but a great brow brown color great mirror on the other side so for things i've been using a lot of are these guys i love i need to do a tutorial on I keep on saying this on um uh cream eyeshadows i use cream eyeshadows all the time all the time i want to get a chanel one i haven't tried the chanel yet but these rimmels are amazing they were hard to find. I can't find them anywhere I live. I happen to be in Bellevue and caught onto a CVS store they have there. Never been to one. Jumped in and they had these. They barely had any Rimmel, but they had these. My Rimmel up here do not have these. I don't know why. They, they just, are they old? I don't know. I just, these are amazing. So if you can find these, they stay on and they're pretty colors and they're not too like greasy because some could be really greasy and these are not. Um, eyeliners. I am down for Marc Jacobs, but the good dupe for Marc Jacobs are Pixies because the creaminess in these is the same creaminess in these. They're both super soft, which I love in, um, I love eyeliners that are like that. Um, I have the brown out and the sparkle brown and the blue. This is like one of my favorites. I use this a lot. I, I just love it. Um, and these guys, I got a liquid one I used today and then a new one and then I got another black brown, but I have brown, brown, what, brown beam and oh, matte mulberry. This color is gorgeous. It's uh, a brown burgundy color. It's beautiful around the eye, mostly for green eyes. So these are great for green eyes. Um, I tend to kind of go towards colors great for green eyes so that it stands out. But you guys check these out. They're like 12 bucks, 12 to 14 dollars. Um, lips. I have a lot of lips. I'm sorry. I'm a lip hoarder. Okay, so first thing at first is I hate the caps on NARS. They don't stay. Mine pops off a lot, which I don't like. Kind of wish it was like a different packaging, just a different type of do that. I got a weird one. Their velvet lips are so far my favorite. I've told you this before. Hands down, if you want some, the best. I love it. Uh, lipsticks, I have been trying, trying, I've been trying, I've been trying bites. This is sugar cane, I believe, yes. And there's another color, a few, a bunch of colors I like a lot. I really, really love their colors. I love the texture, the formulation, it stays on, it does not budge, it goes on not too dry. I'm very impressed with these. Um, I just want to get more. <laughs> I just want to get more. Um, for glasses, I have a ton of glass, sorry, I'm just kind of glassed out right now. Uh, first one is um, Inglot Glosses. We were in a store in Vegas this summer and it was, I was in heaven. So this is zero, this is 63 Inglot and it's um, just a nice pink, pink kind of, taupey kind of color. And it goes on really well. It's super pretty. I love it. And it's kind of like that varnish kind of gloss. So it's really kind of heavy. So it stays on and it's like, mm, it's just on your lips. Love it. Next ones are NYX. I love NYX glasses. These are the Butter Gloss, and I got Tiramisu and Buttercup, I want to say. Oh, Vanilla Cream. Tiramisu and Vanilla Cream. Love these two. Love, love, love. I, I love a lot of those colors. Um, next is an ours. I know. I go back to NARS all the time. Um, this is probably Chihuahua. I love NARS. Hands down, I can probably have the whole collection and use every color. Maybe not every color, but close to every color. Another goodie, but goodie, goodie, goodie ones is one of my fave, ColourPop. I love ColourPop. They don't last totally long. They get kind of goopy. Um, but they, I mean, they last for a while, but then they just kind of get kind of that goopiness, cloudy kind of feeling. Um, this is, I can't remember which one this is, Burgundy, Burgundy Lip Gloss. And this is one of their glosses, and it's really, really pretty. It's just so worn out because I've used it so much. I don't even know. I'll try and find it. But I have Fairy Floss, which is super pretty. Oh, I love this color. And it's like great for nudes. It is so perfect for nudes. And the other one was Echo Park. And this is, this is a gloss. Oh, this is an Ultra Satin Lip. Which they see they get kind of, this one's okay. The other one's kind of, I had to throw some away because they get kind of glumpy. But I really love their satin lips with their, very, their gloss over it. It's really great. Um, and next one is my first one that I've used that I loved. It was my Neutrogena. A lot of people like this. And I got another one that um, I really, really like. And it's pink. It's so pretty. These go on really well. They stayed all day long. 
it did not come off. I mean, and it's super moisturizing. It's the Neutrogena Moisture Smooth Color Sticks. I got the pink. I'm gonna have to go back and get more because I got buy one, get one half off. Love that deal. Who doesn't love a deal? And I'm gonna get more. <laughs> um, the next one is Sephora. You know, I love, oh, I just got one right here. My other Sephora, I don't know where it is, but Sephora lip glosses are wonderful. They're great, they're easy, they're cheap, they're inexpensive, they stay on. Pretty colors, they did really well with the colors, love them. Buxom, love my Buxom. Hands down, Buxoms are one of the top lip glosses out there. Those are like my faves. Um, and as in brushes, I, I don't know. <laughs> I'm not going through my brushes because this is a lot. I just love my brushes. I love my Sigma. I'm loving my Real Techniques brushes that I've got, gotten and I've used a lot of. I'll show you one that I am, okay. And so I love my Luxie. I use it all the time. Elf little brushes are amazing, hands down. Best gel liner, liquid liner brush is the Sanyu Kashuk, love it. I'm loving the Japanese. I hope I'm saying that right. But this little guy, holy cow, holy grail. Under your eyes is amazing, it's soft. You guys, Pixie Woo, you guys did such a great job with these little guys, I love them. I wish you would do a little more little ones like this. Um, another one that I go to all the time. Where are you? Where are you? Here's another one. It's a really soft and goes under and it's a smudger. And I've done, this has been really great for me. I've kind of actually really liked this. Is my it one. And it really, I used it today and oh, blend those puppies out. Blend, 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 blend. I love this brush and it's super soft. So it's just kind of hand down. And my other brushes are the same. They're just the same I've always had. I don't have a ton of brushes, even though I want more and just not a ton. Um, but that is it. That is my favorites of all my kind of other stuff gooped together. Um, best of 2018 of a bunch of stuff. Just now I have a whole load of stuff down on my table. So thanks for tuning in. Don't forget to subscribe and thumbs up and comment below. Um, yes, and that is it. I will see you guys soon at my next video.